We're not gonna talk to Roy just yet. Nope, we're gonna play this smart. We're gonna go do this mission. We'll hit all of them together at one yeah. time. And Except for the nurse. The we nurse? got her. Nurse. Oh, the nurse. nurse. Oh, I, I thought you said like N U R T H. Not the nurse. <laughs> Man. Uh, I, we've mentioned it before. We live in Texas. Yeah. We. I don't think they have that good graffiti. Maybe in like Houston or Maybe. like Dallas, but I mean the best we got is I a think in, really detailed penis. No, I mean we have some murals where we live. I mean there's that big ol. Well, this is the one that's on the side of what is it, True Love? Yeah, yeah, the one that directly states what city we live in. That's good. Blank Town? <laughs> I don't remember. Are we thinking of the same while. mural? I don't think so. I think we are. The one that's like, you're looking beautiful today. Oh! No, that's next to Cafe Cappuccino. Oh. Oh, you're way off. True Love has a um, Blank Town. <laughs> okay. Yeah. No, but we got we got some muralists, but okay, not cool relay. graffiti. Nothing that pops and adds like urban color. Yeah, we or don't really have like people. graffiti style. Oh shit! Yep, these are the cleaners. Yeah, no, you told me. These are my pyros. My second favorite enemy. You ever play Team Fortress, baby? Um, uh, no. No. No, I think it was one that like I always meant to. I love Team Fortress, but, but I think I have the worst experiences with Team Fortress. Because I, I didn't have a good computer to play Team Fortress how it was meant to be, and I got stuck with a PlayStation 3 orange box Team Fortress with all the hackers. Oh, that's not fun. No, but I mean, I still got a lot of the, uh, uh, I guess, camaraderie and the community experience. And plus, I fucking love those, those, uh, those videos they put out. I really wanted to toy around with the, uh, the filmmaker that they put out. Source filmmaker? Yeah, yeah I really want to toy around with that. That'd be fun. Because, like, my computer I mean, shit, one of the main reasons that, like, I mean, you know, but, like, that I even wanted to really get into doing LPs is, I mean, yeah, like, I play a lot of video games, and I think I can hold a good conversation. Yeah, yeah. But Here overall, like, I really like video editing and, like, making movies and... Yeah. No, you know. I know. You, you told me at, like... Oh, yes. Oh. oh I miss. I just, I was just thinking of that, because these guys, Pyro. You know, a lot of people think the Pyro's a girl. Pyro, oh, the... Team Fortress. Team Fortress? Yeah. Isn't that the one that, like, never takes off the mask? Yeah. We have intel that there are multiple... I, get, I think I've heard that. Yeah. They're looking to she's, burn out the I, infection. I, I think... Well, so what was the theory? Be careful. Because she's got, like, a little flower sticker on on one of her lapel things. Uh -huh. Or its lapel things. And it, it has, like, a purse and a soccer. I'm not sure, though. I've just heard it. I thought, I think yeah, I think I saw it like in a video once about like top ten, like Plus, top ten super secret Team Fortress videos that you didn't know existed. Videos. Have I shown you? Like they have the best fucking character videos. I think I've seen the intro to all of them. I remember I saw like the live intro to somebody. Have you seen? And like I remember everyone going like, "Oh my god, I can't believe the." This person or whatever is a character. Oh my god! Oh my god! Oh my oh. god! Um, kind of lost. Okay. Medic has a great video. Uh, Pyros okay. was super hyped about. I remember staying up super late, and they ended up releasing it super late. Uh, but they also have some like really good shorts. The spy is one of the best characters ever. I'm gonna have to show you those videos. This is Fei Lao patching in. We this have help is on probably the way. my favorite character. Down here, 
Head for the secondary Paul Rhodes. relay room. Paul Rhodes. I think you, you told me something bodies, about Paul Rhodes. Get your mask on. Like two episodes no, ago, I think I remember. Yeah, reading about Paul Rhodes, he not of Rhode Island. So Patriot and has a distrust for the division and the government. Is he a true patriot? He's a. He has a patriot gun. Well, currently there's a theory about Paul Rhodes. That I may have mentioned to you before. No. Maybe. I haven't told you any division Ubisoft Paul Rhodes theories. Uh, not that I know of, but you might have. Okay, what? so the running theory right now is that Paul Rhodes is actually Aiden Pierce's father. Oh, and from uh, Watch, Watch Dogs. Dogs. So knowing that eh. before meeting the character, I don't remember what Aiden Pierce fucking looks like. See, everybody He's so gave fucking a lot of bland. He's bland. Everyone gave him grief. Yeah, because he's bland. I think that helped me connect to him, though. Because Baby, there was you're not nothing bland. there. I could, no, but I could imprint my thoughts and my... Oh, that theory is bullshit. It only works with very generic hero stories, like Link. But it worked with that for me. I played the shit out of Watch Dogs. Eh. I, I damn near 100% of that game. Maybe you also played like a year's worth of Destiny. <laughs> yeah, and like they're getting the fucking content update too at the same time. Also, if those guys start to catch on fire nine times out of ten. You gotta says, get the fuck out of there? No. The, oh, I forgot this mission has this fucking <laughs> mechanic in it. But this is why you run a double barrel shotgun. Because you have to pick up these things and put them into that thing. Put the things into the things, get gotcha. them. Yeah, but while you do that, you can't use your weapons and you walk super fucking slow. Ah, uh, okay. And so it forces you to use your sidearm, and, or you can just drop it and kill everybody. You know, that's an option too, but <laughs> if you want to be a cool badass, okay. yeah. oh, like that, <laughs> Shield guys. Where do they get their shields from? Uh, they make oh. it out of wood. Uh, wood and spray or paint. Or plywood or some shit like that, like carbon fiber. Who's gonna like sit down, take the time to make a shield, and then is like, I gotta buy me some spray paint so I can jazz up the shield. Well, I mean, even if it's like total Armageddon, you're gonna have downtime. <laughs> I mean, I guess it would be the last thing I thought of. No, so. I don't think it would, because I think that in the moment where, like, everything else in the world is completely fucked off, you getting to customize and personalize and like, decorate your shield, like, it would, it would be a way I, of coping. Am I not thinking about getting, like, food, safety, shelter? It could be, but let's say that you find, like, Let's say that you find like an old house one day that has food, that's like fresh food, and it still has working water, and like there's a fucking dog there and everything. The Walking Dead prison. That's, yeah, let's say that you find a prison then. Okay. Like, that night, um, when you're laying down, you're gonna, for, even for a brief moment, you're gonna be like... I should buy a boat. Yeah. <laughs> Boat. And then spray paint the boat, cause oh, what the I fuck? The there you are. I think your death count for this playthrough is at zero. It is. Are you saying that I should purposely fix it? No! No, I'm not, that is to. not what I'm saying whatsoever. Now, the contaminated. now we get to go and be Pick all... up the components. Morning. Hostiles inbound on your position. Hostiles inbound on my position. Oh shit. Oh, yeah, they're like super close, aren't they? Oh, baby, they're right there. <laughs> you gotta take it. Oh, uh, I dropped it. No, but where are you gonna take it? Where is it? Oh, these steps over oh, here. Oh, okay. And they, they're just gonna keep on coming until it's in? Well, no, you can kill them all. Oh. Well, then why the fuck don't you just kill them all for. Holy shit! <laughs> This way is way more badass. <laughs> Hold on, let me reload. <laughs> Come here, oh, I'll okay. Hit you. Yeah, that's right. I don't think this is a good idea. <laughs> no, it's fine. Oh, I don't think this is a good idea. <laughs> no, it's fine. Okay, that's fine. Be in the blast radius and not die. 
Yeah, they got out. You went in. No, they they should have been there. See, now everyone's dead. Okay. And now I can just fucking take my time. Even though the music is super hype. This seems like the smarter solution. <laughs> it's just, now I'm just walking. Yeah. So it's a lot. It's heavy. I wish that they would just you place are... like a load of really easy to kill enemies that you can just like, wow, wow, wow. You want the game to suck your dick for you. That's what you're telling me. Yeah, one day, one day is a possibility. I'm gonna be 70 years old. It's like 75 years old. I'm gonna walk in and be like, ah, you're cheating on me with the Xbox 9000? No, you're gonna walk in and I don't know what you're gonna say. Uh, it's gonna like, be weird uh, to the both of us. Yeah. Jesus, this thing is loud. Probably be like, let me join in. Okay, get in the work in the controls. See, doesn't that kind of look? Just want to give you a heads up. Do you ever get to like look at him? We like actually. Oh yeah, he's, he's, does he go back he's to the base? notorious for telling you that he'll talk to you out. later. <laughs> Every time that you go to get. You're, eventually you get to where you can pick up shit around your base yeah. on like an hourly, two hourly rotation um, and every time you go to fucking pick up the tools he's like, look, we both got shit to do right now we'll talk later okay every fucking time maybe he's just like, I gotta be busy, I gotta be busy oh no, main character's coming hey, I'm busy I'll talk to you later. The developers, yeah. when they were asked about that, because there's a lot of characters that they just cycle the same dialogue over and over. It doesn't change at all. And they asked about that, and apparently, um, so the company that, um, Ennis, I think? Ennis? Uh, not Ennis. Um, fucking, it's one of, the, one of the developers that worked on this. They made a Lincoln Tunnel checkpoint the last mission that we did. Mm -hmm. Um, and they made uh, a couple other missions, I think, uh, shit, um, I think a few other missions later on, they may have done, I'm not sure exactly which ones, but they were saying that it was actually their idea to have, uh, or you can thank them for the looping dialogue because they were the ones that made the decision to only put, like, three clips. Yeah. Uh. Which, at times, it's kind of funny. Well, I mean, it saves you some money. Yeah, it does. But then, like, after a while, there's one dude in the game. He just, his back hurts, and he needs Morning. drugs bad. Inbound on your position. <laughs> and it's just, every time you pass him, he's like, just, my back really hurts, man. He's need drugs. Okay. And just like, okay, guy. Does he say drugs? Yeah. Exactly? Yeah. I need drugs, man. Yep. Yeah. yeah, I mean, they talk about all kinds of shit. I have no more med packs, so I gotta make sure that I don't yeah, die. Yeah, you're pretty close there. Yeah. The boss is still coming out. That's fine. It's okay. That's more your people in the elevator. Do I have anything good? I got some water. Where are the other division agents? Like, I know it's the co-op thing, but what the fuck? What about NPC division agents? Uh, they're called the JTF? No. No. So Justice Task Force? Joint Task Force. No, Justice. Justice is cooler. Exactly. Justice is I'm a little bit cooler. I'm guessing that's the boss. Oh yeah, that's the boss. He's a motherfucker. Yeah? He is the oh, yeah, archetype of, of motherfucker. He but is the motherfucker? Which one thing that I really like about, like, the AI is super fucking smart. Yeah, he's gonna but, go around. Yeah, he remembers that I was right there. So if I'm not there, he doesn't auto detect where I'm at. Well, that's so sounds, you. That's normal, baby. But no, I mean, like, I it's, played. It's uh, Vulcan Raven. I've played many a game. You where, remember Vulcan Raven? Yeah. Yeah, he would see you, he'd go to where you were, and then when you weren't there, he'd be like, Where are you, snake? Yeah. yeah. But I mean, I've, I've, I've so recently I've played a lot of really lazy games, I guess. What? Where, like, what? I've seen. I don't know. Like Destiny? I think you're trying to suck this game's dick. I'm not. The game was sucking my dick, remember? That's no, what I thought. It, I think it's mutual. It's a 69. We're just 69ing each other? Adam. 
and Xbox 69 sandwich. A 69 sandwich? Mm -hmm. That implies that there's two it's other people. All, uh, yeah. All right, yeah. Right. System's clean. It's layered it's within clean. itself. Oh, okay. Yeah. I'm like seeing it right now. It's, it's happening right in front of me. And I would like to tell the internet it's pretty juicy. Wrong. It's raw. It's raw? <laughs> raw. Oh, no, I don't want it to be raw. That's fine. I mean, it's a 69. No one's gonna get a... Don't get too raw. Yeah. <laughs> so, I guess while we're heading back, we've got we've got some footage that we can watch. Wait, is this real time elevator? Is it gonna take you super long to get up? But it's gonna go to a loading screen. Oh, okay. One of the few times whenever you do actually hit a loading screen in the game, when you go in elevators. And Agents, when you looks like the travel. power grid is a lot more stable. Thanks to you, we're back in business. Rhodes is already on his way back. How did he beat so no you? An escort. I'll see you when you get here. I don't think that elevator. It looks like Benny. the <laughs> artist started drawing a character and then got really angry and just smudged his finger all over the canvas when he got to the hair. <laughs> it looks like.